Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to share with you my August Ipsy unbagging. I don't know what's in here yet. I just got it in the mail. So if you guys want to find out with me what's in my bag for this month, then just keep on watching. So here is what the August bag looks like. I have a feeling it's gonna be like a back to school kind of theme. We'll see, let's see what's inside. All right, so I'm wrong, it's not a back to school theme. I can't really figure out the theme, but it says confidence level selfie with no filter. So maybe it's just like a confidence theme for August. And I actually do like this bag. It has this cute little tassel and it's the same color as my beach bag. So I feel like this would be good for like Labor Day weekend. And then let's see, this is from Murad. It's the AHA BHA Cleansing Exfoliator or Exfoliating <laughs> Cleanser. I have a feeling that I've used this before. I feel like I used to have like a 500 point perk from Sephora that had this inside, but this is just a deluxe size cleanser from Murad and I'm really low on my cleansers right now so I will be putting this in my shower like today and testing that out right away then this is a product another skincare product maybe it says 111 skin it's a creo activating hydrogel so I want to say it's going to be like a moisturizer. All right, so this is a very lightweight feeling moisturizer. It kind of feels like a primer. So maybe I'll end up using it as a moisturizing primer. I just rubbed it out on my hands like lotion. It actually smells really nice. It smells like a very clean like spa scent. So that's kind of surprising getting two skincare products so far. And then the third product is a pencil. It is a mini universal brow pencil and this is from billion dollar brows it's all packaged up so let me take off the packaging so this is what the pencil looks like let's see what the color okay so it seems kind of like a taupey shade it says universal this is probably like two shades lighter than what i normally use maybe i feel like you could probably get away with using it if you have like darker brows just using it to highlight your brows or if you have lighter brows using it like in the tail of your brow so i'm going to test that out but i'm not sure if that's going to be a universal shade i think it will work for me but i don't know if it will work if you have like blonde hair or black hair and then next i have oh this is oh is this what i've been wanting to try from mac this is the false lashes extreme black no, I want to say that the one that I wanted to try from MAC is that one for bottom lashes that everybody talks about. I'm not sure if this is the same one, but I've never tried a mascara from MAC. Ooh, so that wand fit in that little tube. <laughs> this is like a full size of wand. I want to actually just try this out right now. I have mascara on. Okay, I'm going to have to try this when I'm not wearing mascara. I'm just getting like carried away, but... That's so cool. I love getting MAC products in my Ipsy bag. I know it's like a little sample, but I have like seven mascaras open already, so I'm good with a little sample. I don't need any more mascara right now, but definitely want to try that out probably tomorrow right away so I can see the formula of that one. And then lastly, okay, this is from Lauritzi Cosmetics. I have not heard of that brand before. And it says it's a lip stick, kind of like a stick pencil, like nude stick um, lip products, I want to say. Let's see, yes, it's one of those kind of like lip crayon pencils. And this is like a mauve shade, like a burgundy kind of color. Oh, that is actually like a very pretty color. And it seems kind of like more of a cream finish. It doesn't seem matte. So that would be a really pretty all over color for fall or even as like a lip liner with maybe like a gloss on top. I usually like more matte um, dark lips. So I would probably use this as a lip liner with maybe a liquid lipstick or just use it on its own, but that's like a really pretty fall color, but I'm not ready for those lip colors yet. I'm just wearing like nudes, pinks, oranges, like really vibrant colors for summer. Right now I'm wearing a nude lip, but I've been really into like corals and oranges lately. All right guys, so that is everything for my Ipsy bag. For this month, I got two skincare products, three makeup products, definitely what I'm the most excited for, and I'm glad that this is the biggest sample. In my bag is the facial cleanser from Murad. I feel like that is the majority of the value of the bag this month. And definitely also the mascara from MAC. Even though it is tiny, that's totally fine because I literally have so many mascaras open right now. Every time I buy a new one, I just want to try it right away and then they end up drying out. So that way I can try it and I don't have to worry about it like drying out. So those are definitely my favorite products. Everything else, 
Um, it's just fine. Basically, I haven't heard of these brands. I actually think I'm going to like this moisturizer. It just like felt really nice and it smells really good. And then maybe the lip pencil and the brow pencil I won't use as much. But that's everything for this video. Let me know what you guys got in your bags for this month in the comments below. Let me know if you got the same products or completely different products. Also, make sure you're checking out my description box. I have a huge back to school giveaway going on for the next couple of weeks. It's an international giveaway. There are two winners and it's also a collab with my friend at Zithia Glammed It on YouTube. So definitely check that out. It'll be linked in my description box if you guys want to enter to win a ton of new makeup prizes. So that is going to be everything for today. If you guys like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I'll talk to you guys soon in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.